a psychic client reading. Your soulmate finder. Who is my soulmate? Are you a soulmate finder? As you can imagine, I hear those two sentences frequently as I do a psychic client reading. I am going to tell you now what I have heard, seen and learned from the other side and from God about the true meaning of the term soulmate. The Hollywood version of only one soulmate per lifetime is nice in movies, but it is completely inaccurate. The truth is as follows. When we decide, as souls, to come into this thing called the human experience, we sit down with a group of other souls. We decide, together, to come into each and every lifetime as teachers for each other. Sometimes we are lovers, sometimes family, sometimes friends, sometimes enemies, sometimes oppressor slash oppressed etc. Wayne Dyer says it best with, I think it's the person who can't push your buttons in life. Whoever that person is who can say one thing that pushes your button and you go into a frenzy, that's your soulmate. They're teaching you in that moment that you have not mastered yourself. I think your soulmate is somebody who reminds you constantly that you still have work to do on yourself. You don't really need somebody in there agreeing with and accepting every single thing that you say. This isn't to say that someone should always be disagreeable. I have discovered that we have approximately six to one romantic type soulmates per lifetime. Why so many, you ask? People very often make bad decisions in love. Fear or doubt or issues from the past will make people choose to stay locked down and not really open up to life. If you are in love with one of those people, should you suffer without love for the rest of your life because of that person's choices? No, of course not. You get the opportunity to move on and another potential the one will come into your life. The same case applies to death. People die. The one left behind does not have to live a loveless life because of that death. God or the universe whichever name you feel more comfortable with loves love. God wants you to have love. If what you have in your life right now is not working for you, you can choose to move to higher, better, more fulfilling love at any time. I know when we are in the thick of it, it is often hard to see clearly you do not have to continue to stay in a relationship that is not working or that makes you unhappy. You do have the choice to open up to the soulmate relationship that you are really desiring. There are numerous psychics to choose from on the internet but you want one that brings authentic and accurate answers. Over two decades of experience and 10 plus reviews show that Elizabeth Followay is that psychic. Discover what a psychic reading can do for you when life's demanding challenges come knocking at your doors. <laughs>